All right, here's another video review. This one I just wanted to show off my display of Masterpiece Scale Transformers. Uh, you've probably seen some of the individual videos and just wanted to show you how I currently have everything displayed. And you've probably seen a lot of these in the video. Um, I haven't done specific videos for each of these. Here's Masterpiece Hound, MP47. All the smaller bots Masterpiece I have are knockoffs. But look quite nice. This is official MP36 Megatron and MP44 Optimus, which I've done video reviews for. It's Masterpiece Prowl, again a knockoff, Masterpiece Ironhide a knockoff, and Sunstreaker knockoff, and Wheeljack. And then you've seen my videos with the Gigapower Dinobots. We got Graviter, their version of Sludge, uh, Grasser, their version of Slag, Gutter, their version of Snarl, and Super Tour, their version of Grimlock. And then I've got Fans Toys Sovereign, the 16M movie version. I've got Masterpiece Rodimus, MP9. I've got Fans Toys Rogue, RC. Fans Toys Apache, my latest edition, Springer, which I did a video review of. I did not have the sword out when I did the review. It's quite large, quite cool. And Masterpiece Ultra Magnus in the back there. So currently I have the season three side of the shelf that then blends into season one and two with the Dinobots, Optimus, and Megatron. And as you can see, I'm running low on room on my shelf. I actually have two more Transformers on the way. I actually decided to go with the Deformation Space Skywarp. And I think he's gonna go right there and Hound is gonna move somewhere else on the shelf. And then I also have the Gigapower uh, Swoop. I forget the actual name, G Giganter or something like that. So not sure. I think I'm gonna squeeze him in dino mode next to kind of where Wheeljack is, move these guys forward, move Ironhide. Um, but I have to see how big Swoop is before I can make that decision. I like to orient them all kind of facing the doorway. So when I walk in, that's kind of the, the shot that I get, the view. And then once in the room, you know, they're all kind of angled, but it looks pretty good. And I play around with it and I'm not sure, I used to think I'd have these Dinobots in robot mode as their main mode, but I really starting to uh, fall in love with them as dinosaurs. So I'm not sure if they will be in robot mode or not. And they're not that easy to transform back and forth. So, you know, definitely gonna keep them in dino mode for the time being. Um, but yeah, just wanted to give you Kind of an overview look of all the pieces I've kind of been displaying or showing size com or uh, reviewing and showing size comparisons for and this is where my what my shelf currently looks like um, you know continually get new sell some other ones off um, and keep kind of keep my collection lean and mean but <laughs> over time it is it is definitely growing um, and just to give you a sneak peek at the Johnny Five I've been showing, there he is across the room on his table. So, again, thanks for watching these videos. 
and as always feel free to give me a like and let me know what you think if there's anything of these figures you'd like to see more of or see differently or ask questions or go into more detail about um, feel free to reach out and i'll be happy to do so but for now till next video thanks for watching and we'll see you soon